everyone, we're going to evaluate the integral 1 divided by the square root of x plus 1 plus the square root of x dx. So what I want to do is rationalize my denominator by using my difference of squares here. So what I'm going to do is take my integral and I'm going to take my denominator and take square root of x plus 1 plus square root of x and multiply it by the conjugate. So we have a plus, so we're going to multiply it by a minus b, which is going to be the square root of x plus 1 minus square root of x. Now if I multiply my um, denominator by this, I also have to multiply my numerator by this. Now your denominator is just going to end up being a squared minus b squared where this is your a and this is your b. So we're going to get the integral of square root, I'm going to go ahead and write this as, well, I'll go ahead and write it like this, square root of x plus 1 minus square root of x. And the denominator, when you multiply these two, the radical sign goes away. So you're going to get x uh, plus 1. When you multiply these two, and we're going to put a minus for this minus here, uh, square root of x times the square root of x is just x. All right, and this is dx. I should put dx here. Um, so what happens is this x's go away, and basically we're just dividing by 1. Therefore, our um, simplified answer is just going to be the numerator dx. All right, so now that you have that, we're just going to integrate each of these pieces. And I'm going to write this as um, x plus 1 to the power of 1 half. So let's do that next. So um, we're going to get the integral of x plus 1 to the power of 1 half dx. I'm splitting it up minus the integral of x to the power of 1 half dx. Now this one's pretty easy because we don't have any, our, our constant in front of here is 1. So when we integrate this, we're going to just get, um, uh, you take your x plus 1 and add 1. So that's going to be 3 halves, divide it by 3 halves, which is the same as multiplying it by 2 thirds. All right, minus, same thing for this one, it's just x, and this is going to be um, 2 thirds, to the power of 3 halves plus c. And the only thing you can do different if you want, so we can simplify this and write this as, uh, and this one as well, we can write this as 2 thirds, and since we have uh, 3 of these square roots, we can write it as pull out 1, x plus 1, and uh, times the square root of x plus 1 minus 2 thirds, and this one you can simplify as x times square root of x plus c. Also, if you wanted to, you could also factor out the 2 thirds. You don't have to, but if you did, you would get x plus 1 times the square root of x plus 1 minus x square root of x, um, like that, and then put plus c. But this one's fine this way. And that's it. Thank you. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.